Um, for me, one thing was uh, the stuff we were talking about recently with uh, um, the culturals and the cultural differences. Yeah. Um, just because while I think I knew a little bit, I didn't know as much about um, kind of worldwide how how interesting and, and different cultures are and how um, they're really cool in, in a lot of different ways. Okay. So the global competence last, yeah. week, and last week. Okay. Yeah. Sounds like for some reason or a little bit that the bubble that you live in or you don't has popped. Oh yeah, for sure. I mean, I, I mean, I live here in Cary and I, I mean, I know it's a little smaller, but like Cary's, definitely in a bubble just here in North Carolina, for example. Gary's in a big bubble. Yeah. Okay. Good. Uh, Brendan. Um, one thing I learned is to be a bit more direct when trying to have serious conversations between a manager and an employee. Um, watching the, I guess, the practice scenarios that we did in class kind of helped me realize the, um, you don't need to beat around the bush and just because he's your employee and you've known him for a long time, uh, you have a responsibility as a manager to just be direct and make you get the job done without leaving yourself with exposure. Okay. Yeah, we don't we don't realize that people want us to be direct. People wanna know the good and bad. They don't want you beating around the bush. Then they're always guessing and trying to figure you out. They want you to tell them what you like and don't like, both personally and business. So as a manager, we have to be direct. We're going to get things done quicker and faster and more efficient that way. And people are going to respect us more. And in today's world, we're always trying to beat around the bush. We're too touchy and we're too afraid we're going to offend people. Well, it's going to put you back. So be direct. It's the best advice I can give you on that. All right. What about you, Jacob? Uh, I would say kind of similar to what Matthew said about like the management and employee relationship. And also I learned uh, um, never say you're fired in an interview. Always say let go. And the happier you make your employees, the better you get out of them. Okay. Good. Lee. Um, for me, I would say probably global competence. Like I used to keep up with the news and um like global news and stuff like that but i kind of fallen off and i would say like i definitely feel like re-inspired to to get back to doing that and like keeping up to date and everything yeah i know the news is always bad but to be prepared like for example 